Great minds think alike, Manager Huang. To tell you the truth, we've made a deal with an e-commerce platform and are just waiting for you to join us. So first, we'll make use of their anniversary celebration and put a product ad on their homepage so that more consumers see the product. Then, we'll plan a supply route for all the warehouses across the country to ensure prompt delivery. Your company can also open flagship stores on their platform so they'll deliver the goods. The interest of both parties can be maximized then. I believe this will be a success. That sounds good. Well, I'll look forward to our cooperation. Thank you. You know what? We make excellent partners. You're a pretty good negotiator. <laughs> but the e-commerce platform that you just told him about hasn't promised anything yet. What should we do now? Don't worry. I've got everything under control. What do you mean by that? Before I came here, I consulted with a friend of mine. He said with the current market situation, to get this contract, most of the sales would have to be online. So I already contacted the best e-commerce platform for this product. They're very willing to cooperate with us. Also, they sent me a letter of intent. I'll send it to you. You just need to sort out the paperwork and send it to Pole Island. As for the actual operations, they only need to do the talking. And our job is finished. You really think things through. How come I didn't notice that before? It's not too late to change your mind about me now. We have lots of time to learn more about each other. <laughs> Annie, let's go have a big meal to celebrate. You promised me a meal before. Right. I never go back on my word. Let's go. Oh. Hey, oh. Miss Su, you're oh. here. Hey, how are you? We won first prize in our dance competition and told all of our neighbors. <laughs> so now they want to send their grandkids here to learn dance. You see, all these kids greatly admire your talent. Come on, come on in! Come, come, come! come. I want to dance! Oh my! I want to dance! Oh, oh, dance. Oh, dance. Oh, dance. <laughs> hey, what's going on here? Hey, dear? honey! Come and take a look! <laughs> Where are all these cute kids from? This is because of you! These ladies won first prize in their competition and gave us free advertising! Yeah, that's right! Yeah. Yeah. That's you know, some of them have been school teachers for decades already! and have lots of students. Each class of each grade has their own WeChat group. And the teachers told them that if their children want to learn to dance, now is the best time. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Oh my, you know, Tian Yue, I've already learned Chinese, but I think it'll take a long time for me to fully learn how things work here in China. Yeah, of course. How can you learn the customs of a country so quickly? Am I right? Yeah, yeah. That's right. Yeah. Right, just like the more I know about Sue Mi, the more I feel she's so awesome. <laughs> take the kids to their class. Yes, right. Don't just stand there, dear. Go and take good care of these kids. Oh, yes. Thank you so much, everyone. Come, children. Come thank with me. You. Go on. You're so Go kind. Go hey, come in, come, come in. Come on. Thanks. Come on. Here, please sit down. I'll get you some tea, all right? Hello, Mr. Ma. Ah, uh, Tian Yue. I have a slight problem. The tour guide for Dreamland to the Ocean suddenly fell ill. Uh, and from the schedule, you are the most suitable to replace them. So, get ready to board. Huh? Wait, Mr. Ma. Didn't I tell you that I'd go anywhere but the cruise ship? As someone else. I'll go anywhere but on that ship, okay? You promised me. Who promised you that, huh? This is your job, and you don't have the right to refuse, you know that? Are you the manager the or am I the manager? The manager? Hey, Dean Kai is still on a mandatory vacation right now. So he won't be on this cruise. Really? Really? Hello? Hey, are you listening to me? Do you want to get fired? Huh? Are you sure? I'm sure. Uh, uh, listen. Uh, don't be angry. All right. I'll go. I'll lead this, all right? That's what you should say. Work hard. Yeah. I'm sorry, I... That's fine, but you should watch where you're going, and be careful. If you run into passengers, that would be bad. Oh yes, Step Captain. It won't happen ever again. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. We'll be careful. 
Look how reckless you are. You could've been fired. Why didn't he scout you? That's because... I'm too beautiful? <laughs> Come off it. I think Elson is in a good mood. Because he'll be promoted soon. He's going to be captain, so he's too happy to lecture you. <gasps> Thank goodness for that. There's nothing worse than being scolded. Come on, let's get going. And then we sent a raft there. Hey. What's this? <laughs> Since alcohol is prohibited on the bridge, I got us a cake. We'll celebrate after the appointment letter comes in. But we can't have a cake on the bridge either. We can share it later in the cafeteria. Well, in that case, congratulations in advance, Staff Captain. Waiting for your orders, Captain. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Yes, little boy? Miss, I want to go to the cafeteria. Oh, over there. Take the elevator to the 14th floor. Ladies and gentlemen, our brand new Captain Olsen is here. Ta-da! Hello, everyone. I'm your new captain, Hathaway. Well, under the leadership of our new captain, I believe we will reach the next level. Come on. Welcome, Captain. Welcome, Captain. Welcome, Captain. Welcome. It's the beginning of our cooperation, and I believe everything will go well. I've learned from our head office that Dreamland of the Ocean is great. And under the previous captain's lead, the ship has gained a very good reputation. It's an honor and great pleasure for me to be the new captain of Dreamland of the Ocean. Although we have all done a good job so far, but I believe we should always constantly work on our way to perfection. But... I noticed something I'm not satisfied with when I first walked on board. A little boy was in need of the staff's help, and nobody paid attention to him. When finally someone helped him, the person didn't kneel down. It's against our standard of services. When we make conversation with other people, being at the same height with that person not only makes for a smooth conversation, but also represents equal status. This mindset should be emphasized when talking with children. 
A child might be small in size, but everyone deserves the same treatment. I don't want this to happen on my ship again. I hope everyone will do their best to make our ship the best. Screw whoever the new captain is. I don't want them to wreck my cake. We're employees of this company. That means we must obey the company's decisions. I won't ask questions when an opportunity comes my way. Now that it hasn't, I'll just do my duties as staff captain. Don't worry. Say the word. And I have ways to let this Hathaway know what she's dealing with. Don't mix business with your feelings. I won't allow anything that'll harm the company or its image. However, preparing a little test to see what the new captain is made of might be considered to be for the company's own good. <clears throat> Hello, I'd like to welcome all of our VIP guests. I'm He Tai, the tour guide from Belfort Travel Agency. During this voyage, I will be solely responsible for you and any problems. Please continue taking a rest while I do a roll call. First up, we have Mr. and Mrs. Ko. You are... Here. Here. Hello. Dong Bin. Sorry, I'm late. I'm Dong Bin. Hello. I'll be your tour guide, He Tai. So during the voyage, if you have any trouble, make sure to find me. Okay. All right, everyone. Right now, I'll hand out your cruise cards. Here, Mr. and Mrs. Ko. Oh. Thank, thank you. you. Mm, Mr. Xiao? Yes, thank you. Hello, welcome. Be careful. Gather over there, please. Watch your step. Be careful. Slowly, everyone, please gather over here. Come on, Come over here, please. Hello everyone, I'm your tour guide, Tian Yue. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact me, okay? okay. Thank you. Thank you. The paper I'll give you now is your boarding pass. Look at you. You still studying while traveling? Don't Relax lose it, okay? But tell me if you do. Take a look at this. What do it's you yours. think of this Here little room I created? Don't lose I it. I can put anything I like in the room. It still needs a sofa. I can't wait to get it. Everyone if has you make one. me angry, I'll one trap you in this everyone. little room, and you'll Your be my servant. It. Take a Got look. it? Don't mess with me. Your I wouldn't dare. It. Take a look. It's more likely you'll bully me. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No, Chum. Yours. Thank you. Hey, it's you again. Hey, Tianyue. How are you? Last time you brought a drone. So what prohibited things did you bring this time? Search me. <laughs> <laughs> Take this. Thank you. Don't lose it. Mm -hmm. Everyone. You've all come to the ship to relax, so feel free to move around after boarding the ship. Okay. okay. Come with me. Okay. This way. Okay. 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 Let's go. Captain, the port is very busy. We must expect a late arrival. Unacceptable. We have to ensure the safe, on-time arrival of all of our passengers. Talk to the port. Yes, Captain. Furthermore. I would like you to double check each and every department in advance. We must always be fully prepared. Yes, Captain, no problem. Captain, there's a problem in the engine room. What's wrong? One of the diesel engines. The alarm was activated. Let's go and check. So, which machine is broken? It's this one. You have a light?
Apparently, the charge pressure system is insufficient. Activate the spare equipment immediately. Also, check the oil circuit, the fuel injection pump, and the air intake pipe. I believe the admission pipe is filled with sand. The sand was sucked up into the water circulation system, causing a blockage. So please check the cooling, water pump, the oil cooler, and the crankshaft system. Adjust the fuel injection pump and the spray nozzle. Chief Engineer, you're doing the right thing by reporting any problems to me. Thank you. There's nothing wrong with that. But I believe you should be able to handle this minor situation, right? Yep. I believe in your capability. I also believe we will do a better job altogether, since everyone knows how to do it and when to do it as a team. When such a pretty girl asks for help, how can I refuse? What's this about? Please help me check his financial position and buying power. Whatever for? I can't be deceived again. <laughs> I do have information about our VIP passengers, but I can't abuse my power and tell you their personal info. You won't help me? I'm sorry. But I can't. Fine. And here I thought that we were friends. I'll figure it out myself. Huts high. Huts high. I think we should talk about our relationship. What you said makes rules. sense. Excuse me, gentlemen. You can't smoke here. And who are you to lecture who is me? This dude? <laughs> I'm a nobody. I'm just like you, an ordinary tourist. Why can't I smoke here? Yeah, why can't we smoke here? Yeah, why can't we smoke here? This is a non smoking deck. If you really want to smoke, there's a designated smoking area. I'm being serious, guys. If you insist on smoking here, you'll be heavily fined in accordance with the boat safety management regulations. You're threatening me? No, I'm not, actually. Let me tell you this. I'll smoke here today. So what are you going to do? I'm sorry. You want to fight? <laughs> Please let me go. I won't. What can you do to me? If you really insist on doing this, you'll be making a more serious mistake. I don't give a damn. <laughs> How do you feel? Are you okay? Do I really look that weak to you? <laughs> Good, you're fine enough to joke. I know I made a mistake. I really shouldn't have gotten involved. The working crew member should have dealt with it, right? How's that guy? You'll learn fast. Security has detained him. And how come you're here now? Aren't you on vacation? Whenever I have too much free time, I miss our life on the sea very much. <laughs> Liar. What? Liar? What's that mean? I'm pretty sure you know. Tianyue is leaning in the group here. Didn't you come here because of her? You're saying Tianyue is here? On the ship? And you didn't know? I...
This is scheduled for your group. Tell me if anything needs to be adjusted. We can discuss it and try our best to satisfy everyone. Okay, I got it. What happened earlier, I hope you don't take it to heart. I really meant well. If you don't have a place to live now, just move back in. I still have that place. Don't keep it for my sake. I know what you're worried about, but Blax, I'll stay away from Dinkai. I won't be an obstacle. This is the first cruise with Hathaway as captain. Headquarters is watching us closely. Wang Ziyang, I heard something happened. Someone was smoking in the non-smoking area. Think I stopped the guest, and they had a conflict. Ding Kai? He's on board as well? Yes, he's one of the guests this time. Oh. If there's nothing else, I'll go back to my post. Yes, of course. Go on, and do your best to assist Hathaway. Just follow her orders. Francis, you too. Hmm. I'll always respect your orders, Staff Captain. It's not his style to just be a guest. He's a complete mystery to us. Do you think he's got something in mind? This time, one of our stops is the accident site of the Blue Star. We're going to stop at four ports during this cruise. The time arrangement is rather tight. We need everyone to collaborate together. Hashmi, David, inform our staff. They must treat all the passengers with equal respect and the kind of service we promise. Remember, every one of our passengers is an honored guest. Okay, Captain. Captain? That's always been our philosophy of service. Very good. <laughs> I'm very glad that our colleagues from the engineering department are taking their jobs seriously. They reported to me immediately when a problem occurred. It must be the result of years of good collaboration, especially from our previous captain, staff captain, and chief engineer. Under your leadership, Captain, I know we're gonna do great. <laughs> All right, let's go back to work. Right. Okay. Follow me, everyone. Oh, Here, this way. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Be careful. Come, come this way. Be careful. Don't run. Be careful. It's gorgeous! I love it! It's breathtaking! So beautiful! Wow! Too. Just for work? No work. 
I just happened to see a passenger named Dinkai on the guest list, so I came. You're never that free. Maybe it's a secret reason. If it is, then I won't ask anymore. The truth is, I really do have some confidential work. <laughs> so why did you come? Is there any special reason? I joined this cruise to look at the ship from a different angle. Look at it from a different angle. That's a unique idea. How did you think of that? The previous captain taught me this right before he left. Hey, say Annie, I want to ask you something. Why did you rent a place for Tianyue and keep it from me? I did it for you. For me, huh? Company Polly says crew members aren't allowed to date our guests. So if the company found out she lives with you, guess what would they think? Besides, you're one of the key candidates of the Asian Talent Reserve Plan. If they use it against you, your entire career will be ruined, you know that. I just thought I should give you a hand when you needed it. As far as I know, Tanya went to live with you because she had no place to stay. You're such a nice man, you wouldn't be able to make her leave. Can't you see I did you a big favor? Alright, I understand. That makes a lot of sense. I should thank you. How to thank me? You choose. Buy me dinner. Sure. Oh my god! Such a big piece of potato skin! How come it got stuck in the drain? Who did this? Hey! Hey, was it you? Not me. You? 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 Who built the potatoes today? Raise your hands. Tell me, who can't even do such a small job well? <laughs> oh, what's so funny? Hey, don't, don't, don't. Show me, show me, show me. Oh, funny. <laughs> Didn't you hear what I just said to everyone else? Did you peel the potatoes today? Any problem? Oh, any problem? Any problem? Didn't you didn't hear me before? <sighs> didn't I tell you before? You have to be far more careful. You, you can't just do what you want. You have to strictly follow the procedures here. So, I will ask you again. How come there was such a big piece of potato skin stuck inside the sink drain? You should be more flexible. What? 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 I... I, 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 I didn't hear clearly. You, you're dissatisfied, huh? Let me tell you, in this kitchen, I am the boss. You, your uncle is a good friend of mine. But if you don't do your job well, I will have to kick you out. Do you hear me this time? And your phone, I'll return it to you after work, hmm? And you guys! Headquarters said there will be an inspection. They said that our kitchen cleanliness is their top priority. So guys, do your best and work even harder. Okay, don't make any mistakes. Do you hear me? Yes, Chef. You hear me? Yes, sir. I really can't believe you guys sometimes. Just a potato. A man should just be like a potato. Fried, boiled, or stewed. It still tastes good. So versatile. I can't believe his wife can put up with him. Maybe his wife likes his temper. Impossible. All women like gentle guys. <laughs> Sounds like you know a lot about women. <laughs> <laughs> of course, I'm a ladies man. Hey. Oh, no, you're man. not. <laughs> you stop bragging already, will you? Only blind girls would like you. Uh. Hey, how can you say that? I'm a charming guy. <laughs> <laughs> I suddenly want to make a bet with you, man. Okay. Everyone come over here. Listen to me. Everyone writes the name of a female crew member, mm. and you pick one. And whoever you pick, try to woo her. If she agrees to date you, you'll win, okay? Yeah. No problem. Come on, boys. One for come you. On. OK. 
okay? Hey, let me see. Mm. All right. Mm. Pick one. Hey, hush me. <laughs> This girl won't be easy to impress. <laughs> Good luck, buddy. <laughs> Why are you here? Why can't I be here? Aren't you on vacation? I want to experience life on the ship under another identity. That's not okay. It's fine. Enjoy your time. <laughs> I have a question. All right. Why did you suddenly move out of my place? Huh? I... I've got a new place to live. I said that was a temporary solution. I can't stay there forever. Why can't you stay forever? Ding Hai. Hi. I've been looking for you. Turns out you're here. Hi, Ding Hai. Someone's sitting here. Really? Ding Hai, why don't we sit over there? Uh, Ms. Chen, you can sit here. My mom and I will sit back there. But your... your food... Got you something. How did you know this was my favorite brand? It's only sold abroad, and you're not good at cooking. So I guess you use soy sauce a lot. You're wrong about that. I cook very well. You can ask Tian Yue, don't I? I haven't tried your cooking. How do I know if it's good or not? You can cook for me when we're back in Shanghai. Okay, we can invite some friends over and have dinner together. Then will you cook me something yummy whenever I want you to? Hey, so you want to try this? You vegetarians can enjoy it. I eat meat. Hey, Tanya, you finished eating? Toilet break. Oh. Mom, Mom, here, here. Oh. What happened? I'll go to the bathroom. Calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down! <sighs> don't let your thinking get carried away, you hear me? He has nothing to do with you now, so don't let him affect your mood, do you hear me? Do you hear me? Tia, are you okay? You don't look so good. Huh? I'm just fine. <sighs> Think I really cares about you. After all, you're a friend he met on the ship. It's not what you think. The two of us aren't as close as you think. Look, I know. You're angry with me about what I did before. Otherwise, you'd have a good chance with him, right? Hang on. What do you mean by that? I spent a lot of time abroad, so I'm straightforward. Ding Kai, he is indeed a very good marriage prospect. He is handsome, and well paid. Most importantly, he's a good man. What you mean by that is, I deliberately try to live at Jinkai's place, just to seduce him and marry him? I'm sure you want to marry an excellent man, and I understand that. There's nothing wrong with that. The woman at your agency called He Tsai, isn't she like that? You're really disrespectful. Oh, please listen. 
I respect the choice that the two of you make. I respect everyone's choice. However, your future choice can't negatively affect Dinkai's future. I have already moved out. Stay far away from him. <sighs> you like Dinkai? Yes, I like him. And I'm also certain that I'm the better match for Dinkai. Marrying me is his best option. <laughs> What's so funny? I'm thinking I should have recorded what you said and had Dinkai hear it. How would he react if he knew that you had decided his marriage for him in the toilet? <laughs> so you'll back off? Captain, for the safety training, I hope you can come to give us advice. Okay, I will join too. Dinkai was responsible for the safety training, right? Yes, it was Dinkai. But rest assured, I am completely capable of this job. <laughs> I believe that every single employee on this ship is extraordinary. I didn't expect that you would be so fast. What do you mean? No need to pretend in front of me, man. You came to see Hathaway. Whatever for? You think I don't know? After the rescue incident and the kidnapping incident, Dinkai hasn't been fully reinstated yet. His position hasn't been decided. So in terms of the reserve plan, we two are the most promising candidates. I've gotten to where I am today, because of my own ability. That's so. Don't forget, this industry has always been dominated by Westerners, not Asians. That was before. More Asians would take the position of captain. Nothing in this world is immutable. You must have heard of the inspection, right? You are the face of the company. When serving the guests, we must be more energetic and careful. We can't neglect any of our guests. Now get back to work. Di Xiang, do you have a lighter? Of course not. Then how did you light my heart on fire? <laughs> this guy. You must have been or carbonated drink in your last life. That's why I want to bubble over with happiness every time I see you. You think I'm soda water? <laughs> Fan Chiang, don't mess with my staff. Go back to the kitchen right now. I didn't realize earlier. You're just like a relative of mine. That's nonsense. I'm like your relative? My mom's daughter-in-law. <laughs> All right, our meeting is over. Ignore him if he stays here. Get to work. <laughs> Check every corner. I don't want any trouble. Okay. Check with Helen if the new tools have come yet. Okay. I got a superpower. What on earth do you want? I have a new superpower. Is that so? Whenever I close my eyes, I see you. I think your superpower will disappear later tonight. If you're ill, go see a doctor. I'm sure Duca will give you time off. Don't come harass me again, or I won't be nice. Don't be so mean. I. If you keep doing this, I can get you kicked off the boat. She's tough. I like it.
相遇在一座城，相遇在某个人潮汹涌、孤单的路口，相识于一片天，相识在蔚蓝海洋中，生活的另一面，梦想的事发现，不经意的转弯，终点又回到起点。是一个同心的圆，从彼岸到此间，最美的少年。每一次停靠，都是为了下一个起点；每一次启程，拥抱着。每一次看完，看完家灯火人间团圆；每一次起航，追逐永不消失的地平线。移动的海岸线，从天边到眼前，生命的延长线，不再那么遥远。善良的夏天。